Hi, this is Brad with Credit Sense. I want to talk to you about credit card interest and how that impacts you as a consumer and the relationship that you have when you take on a credit card with your banks. Notice if you have a $5,000 balance or a $5,000 limit and you've run it up to $5,000. If you're paying the minimum payments, it'll take you 26 years to pay off that credit card balance at an 18% interest card. If your card's 21% or more, it's going to take longer. Now, the key to this is that with the bank, you're going to pay them $7,700 in interest. Their exposure is $500. They need to have 10% on their books to be able to lend you or extend you the credit for that credit card. Now, this co comes into play. If you remember, we've talked a few times about fractional re uh, reserve lending. This is another example of that. This is important when it comes down to time. If you're ever in a situation where you have uh, a credit card that you're not being able to pay, you're trying to negotiate a lower balance, remember how much the bank has on the line. At $500, they're made whole on the capital that they had to have on the line to lend you the credit card or to lend you that amount to be able to go out and use that credit card. If they have $500 on the line, there's a lot of negotiation room in here so that they can still make a profit and so that you can save yourself a little bit of time and a little bit of money when it comes to paying things off. With your FICO score, getting a lower interest rate is going to be key to being able to not get in a situation where you're paying over 26 years on a $5,000 card at a minimum payment. Now, of course, if you can make higher payments, that's going to help as well. But just remember, a, high FICO, a higher FICO score, like a Tier 1 FICO score, is going to give you the best interest rates, the lowest interest rates on your credit cards and any other lending that you take part of. And it's going to empower you to have a better credit experience and become a more knowledgeable and powerful consumer. This is Brad with Credit Sense, and that makes sense to me.